Bats will I be good enough to take you down one of these days. Besides, there might be bigger things to worry about. I find myself intrigued by the ghost tales that everyone's mentioning. Other than what Dawnstar senses, all I have is stories, but they're becoming more and more common. Tales of people being haunted by loved ones, and mad ghosts attacking people on the roads, or even in their homes. And Master Lee accepts Dawnstar's ability to see and sense things others can't. If he believes her, then how could I believe otherwise? They're exactly what you'd expect. The souls of humans who have died. According to all the legends, when you die, your soul travels to the underworld. Once there, your soul is judged and placed upon the wheel of life, so that it can return to this world in a new life. A soul that doesn't return to the wheel of life becomes a ghost. If you wish, what do you want to ask about? Of course. I have to keep practicing if I'm going to be able to vest you one day, aren't I? Excellent. Let's see if we can use Smiling Mountain Sparring Ground. Once we're done, I'll wander back here if you need me again. Thousand cuts! much better. I thought I'd do something different today and stream this. Senior student, and not too many people come back here this time of day, so we thought we'd take a moment to practice. Would you like to join us? We could team up against you and learn from the best. This is good news! That's 
enough! I didn't think we'd win, but it was an honor to face you. Thank you very much. We have to go. Smiling Mountain's going to be teaching a class soon, and then we have weapons training. Monkey! Oh, you're finally here to talk to Master Lee, are you? I certainly hope so. The old man is in there meditating, and he won't train me until he talks to you. Really? You would have dropped everything to make way for me. I don't think so. You're far too important to waste time worrying about my education. Master Lee certainly considers your training important enough to shove all others aside, so why shouldn't I bow down to your greatness? You don't want my answer to that question. Go talk to one of your sandal-licking friends and let them tell you I'm jealous. I'm sure Wen could stammer out an answer for you, something to make you feel all warm inside and just great about yourself. Master Lee wants to talk to you. Do me a favor and go talk to him. Then maybe I can actually receive some education at this school. Ah, there you are, my student. I watched your bout against Jingwu with great pride. You have gained almost all you can from the practice arena. You are my best pupil. Though you came to me an orphan, I have tried to prepare you for the responsibility your skills will bring. Have you given thought to your future? Your lessons are complete. Remember these basic skills and keep them at heart. But also remember the classes are not a true measure of ability. Always be ready to learn. I recall that, as a child, you fell and bruised your arm. I comforted you, saying that small pains are part of learning, but not every setback imparts wisdom. You must be careful. Sometimes all you learn in defeat is that you have been defeated. This world is out of balance. Spirits grow restless, and you have a role to play that I have kept secret. Those who announce their important destiny before they are ready tend to meet unfortunate ends. The wise only seek attention when capable of dealing with it. The people are scared. I do not have all the answers, but I know you will become very important to the fates of many. You will be called to face a great evil. Master! Master Lee! What is this interruption? This had better be important. There is much to say. Master, Nijo came to warn me. He saw a boat from the Outlook past the fields. Strange outlaws. They, 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 they fired something at him. And Kiamin was injured. Where is she now? Still outside the village by the Outlook. Nijo couldn't carry her. Please come, Master Lee. The bandits are not at the village yet, but they could arrive at any time. Hmm. We will have to continue our discussion later, my student. It appears we have more pressing matters. The time for practice is over. Go to Gujin, the weapon master, and get a weapon. You may soon be called to use it. On your way, make certain Dawnstar is aware of the danger. Her skills have always complemented yours, so take her with you. Prepare yourself for a potential attack while I tend to my fallen student. I will return as soon as I can. 
We will continue our discussion when the threat is over. Good. The time comes when you will know all you need to. For now, keep the basics at heart. What's the matter, Dawnstar? Are you scared that Master Lee might find out? There is talk of approaching bandits, and you bother me with unsubtle advances. How very like you, Gao. No doubt a tactic learned from your criminal father. His name is Gao the Greater, and he built a fortune out of some ragged thieves and slave traders. If my charm can't lift your spirit, I'll buy the ground from under you. Flaunting your father's undeserved wealth does not impress me, Gao. It only serves to push me further away. You step beyond your station. She and I are discussing her future. Thank you, Gao, but I'll pick my own poison. Now leave, and if you'd be so kind, stay downwind. I won't forget this, Dawnstar. You show great disrespect. You as well. You will not take all the glory if there is an attack. We are not through. Oh, he is Gao the Lesser in all respects. I thought Master Lee allowed him to stay so that the influence of the father could be countered, but Gao never learns. He acts like he's above Master Lee's teachings. Such are the conceits of wealth, I suppose. I appreciate that you arrived when you <coughs> That is nice to hear. Gao could learn much from you if you wanted to learn anything from anyone. Yes, he said you were coming. He just passed here with C. Pat on his way to help Kia Min. It's strange that simple bandits would launch such a raid. Master Lee was concerned that this would interrupt your training. His respect for your potential is just so absolute. Has he told you any more about your future? your bad feelings they always end up being right remember the grass fire half of the field's gone in a day